Last week, the Marauders opened their 2012 season with a convincing win over West Virginia Wesleyan. Head coach Greg Colby said the team had a good week of preparation for this week's opponent, the Mercyhurst Lakers. It's been a good week overall. Um, you know, guys were obviously in a good mood after the game uh, when we came back Sunday, and uh, you know they've been practicing hard. Although you know it's been a little bit of a disrupted week, we had a little bit of rain on Tuesday and lost half our practice, so we had to try to make that up yesterday on Thursday when we really want to try to taper a little bit. So that's a little bit of a concern, but overall it was a good week. Uh, guys worked hard, and I think uh, they came away from the, that last week's game knowing that uh, you know it was a good game, but we got to move on to the next one. Mercyhurst has a lot of athletes that can pose a challenge to Millersville, especially in the special teams department. You know, they've got a lot of good athletes. They've got a, a lot of players that, that uh, I think are, are um, can threaten and, and can do a lot of things for them. Uh, you know, offensively, obviously, they put 40-some points on the board, which is something that you need to be concerned with anytime you're out there on the field. Their special teams, especially their kick return team, uh, re I think they had one return for 85 yards, another for about 50. Uh, they're averaging 50-some yards of return after that game, which obviously, you know, we've got to corral that. We can't give them that kind of field position. So, uh, you know, I think they're an explosive team that uh, has had success in the past, and I know they're going to be a lot better this week than they were last week. Colby says Millersville needs to play an upbeat, up-tempo style of play to ensure that the team puts itself in a position to win this week's matchup. Well, we've got to we've got to play the kind of tempo that that we're designed to play, and that's an upbeat, up-tempo, uh, get after you kind of a offense and defense, and and uh, you know use our conditioning and use our our uh, uh, the way we play as a weapon for us. And we did that last week, and it was a little bit hot. I think we wore wore West Virginia down a little bit by the end of the game, and uh, you know hopefully we'll be able to do that again this week. But we've got to, we've got to minimize our mistakes. We've got to correct some of the things that we had happen in the game. We left about 10 or 15 points on the field last Saturday and can't afford to do that against uh, the teams as we move on through the season. The Marauder rushing game will be key this week, not only to the success of the offense, but also to the success of the defense, where Colby says the rushing attack will help to keep a powerful Mercyhurst offense off the field. To me, it's going to be critical because uh, you know we, we've got to be able to do uh, both run and pass the ball. But especially if we can control the ball running, it's going to open up the pass game. It's going to open up everything that we do offensively. But at the same time, maybe even more important, it's going to keep our defense off the field and keep their offense off the field. And obviously, their offense is, has some potent uh, ability. So if we can keep them off the field, that's that's going to be that much better all the way around for us.